Today, we will learn subtraction of integers. We come across many situations in our life where it becomes necessary to perform subtraction of integers. For example, subtraction of temperatures, subtraction of distances, subtraction of profits or subtraction of losses. Let us learn how to perform subtraction of integers in these situations. First, we will understand how to do subtraction of positive integers. Suppose the temperature of a place is 3 degrees centigrade. If it increases to 7 degrees centigrade, then what is the rise in temperature? In order to find out, we need to subtract 3 degrees centigrade from 7 degrees centigrade. That means we need to subtract plus 3 from plus 7. Whenever we have to subtract an integer from another integer, then we will add the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted to the first integer. The additive inverse of any number can be obtained by changing its sign. So the additive inverse of plus 3 is minus 3. Therefore, the addition can be written as plus 7 plus minus 3. Here, you can see this one is a positive integer and the other one is a negative integer. Can you tell how to carry out this addition? Think for a while. Let me tell you. To find out the sum of these, first, we will find the numeral value, that is, the number without a sign. The numeral value of plus 7 is 7 and the numeral value of minus 3 is 3. Now, we will subtract the smaller numeral value, which is 3, from the larger numeral value, which is 7. The result obtained is 4. Now, we will put the sign of the number whose numeral value is larger, which is plus. Therefore, the result will be plus 4. From the result, it is clear that there is an increase of 4 degrees centigrade in the temperature. Subtraction of integers can also be done on a number line. Here, first we will convert the operation of subtraction into an operation of addition. This means, in the place of plus 7, minus plus 3, we will write plus 7, plus minus 3. Now, the first number is plus 7. Since this is a positive integer, we will move 7 steps to the right of 0. By doing this, we will reach the number plus 7. The other number is minus 3. Since this is a negative integer, we will move 3 steps towards the left. Thus, we reach plus 4, which is the result of subtraction of plus 7 and plus 3. Now, we will understand how to do subtraction of negative integers. Suppose the temperature of a place decreases from minus 3 and reaches minus 7. So, the decrease in temperature can be found by subtracting minus 3 from minus 7. In this case also, we will find the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted, that is plus 3, and we will add this to minus 7. In order to add plus 3 to minus 7, first, we will subtract the smaller numeral value that is, number without sign, from the larger numeral value. And then, we will put the sign of that number whose numeral value is larger. By doing so, we obtain the result minus 4. From the result, it is clear that the temperature has decreased by 4 degrees centigrade. We can also perform the subtraction of these numbers on the number line. Here also, we will convert the operation of subtraction into operation of addition. That means, in the place of minus 7 minus minus 3, we will write minus 7 plus plus 3. Now, the first number is minus 7. Since this is a negative integer, we will move 7 steps to the left side of 0. By doing so, we will reach the number minus 7. The other number is plus 3. Since this is a positive integer, we will move 3 steps towards the right of minus 7. Thus, we reach minus 4, which is the result of the subtraction of minus 7 and minus 3. 
In the same way, we can perform subtraction on a positive integer and a negative integer. Suppose the temperature at a place is 3 degrees centigrade. If it decreases and reaches minus 7 degrees centigrade, then the decrease in temperature can be found by subtracting plus 3 from minus 7. Even in this case, we will find the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted, that is, minus 3. Then, we will add this to minus 7. As you can see, the sign is the same in both, minus 7 and minus 3. Therefore, we will add the numeral values of these numbers. And, we will put the sign of these numbers, that is, minus sign, with the result. Thus, the result obtained is minus 10. In order to obtain the result of minus 7 minus plus 3 on the number line, first, we will convert it into the operation of addition, that is, minus 7 plus minus 3. The first number is minus 7. So, we will move 7 steps towards the left of 0. The second number is minus 3. So, we will again move 3 steps towards the left of minus 7. Thus, we reach minus 10. That means the result is minus 10. Today, we have learnt that whenever we need to subtract one integer from another integer, we need to add the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted to the first integer.